Hi everyone. In this video, I am going to introduce two more noise uh, temperatures. Uh, those are effective noise temperature and system noise temperature. What are the two parameters I am going to introduce? So, introducing effective noise temperature. So, effective noise temperature or noise temperature TE. Another one is system noise temperature. System noise temperature. System noise temperature indicated by TS. Okay, these are the two factors I am going to introduce in this and with respect to noise figure only. Okay. So, what do you mean by noise figure? Noise figure is nothing but it is defined as two definition I have told you in the previous video and expression also been derived in the previous video. So, two, what are the two definitions? Noise figure is defined as the ratio of signal to noise ratio of the input divided by signal to noise ratio of the output. The ratio of signal to noise ratio to the signal to noise ratio of the input to the signal to noise ratio of the output. What is another definition? Noise figure is defined as the ratio of noise out of practical receiver to the noise out of ideal receiver. Okay, I will write that definition. So, the noise figure, see because this noise temperature will come from that noise figure only. Noise figure indicated by Fn is defined as the noise out of practical receiver to the is defined as the ratio of is defined as the ratio of noise out of practical receiver to the noise out of ideal receiver Okay, so Fn is equal to noise out of practical receiver divided by noise out of ideal receiver. Okay, so noise out of practical receiver, we don't know how much it is. So just we are taking noise out divided by what is the ideal noise of the network? Ideal noise is nothing but thermal noise. KT not BN when it is passing through the network, gain of the network will be added, which is nothing but available gain S out by S in. Gain is nothing but we know output by input. Here output is nothing but S out by S in. So N out. What is N out? N out is nothing but practical receiver noise. Practical receiver or practical network noise is ideal network noise plus noise introduced by the network itself okay that we can write it as kt not bn g plus delta n divided by kt not bn into g so when we are simplifying this we will get fn is equal to 1 plus delta n by kt not bn into g this is what we have got the noise figure expression in the previous video as well. Now, using this equation 1, we need to get what should be the noise temperature, effective noise temperature. Okay, how to calculate the effective noise temperature? What do you mean by effective noise temperature? What is delta in here? What is delta in here? If you focus on delta n, then you will get what is Te. Okay, so delta n is nothing but here delta n is nothing but the noise introduced by the network itself without having effect of any other actional parameters. <coughs> okay, delta n is nothing but noise introduced by the network itself. So, how can you write delta n? 
delta n is equal to k t b n delta n is equal to k t b n when it is passing through that network gain of the network will be added now if you see the k value k is nothing but boltzmann's constant which is uh, constant forever and bn is the noise bandwidth it is also constant because the noise bandwidth is decided by the network what is the amount of noise that passes through the network that is decided by the bandwidth see here suppose take a practical receiver i am talking about practical receiver ideal receiver we cannot do anything ideal receiver it only gives a noise of thermal noise okay we cannot change the thermal noise johnson noise that is fixed and this practical network or practical receiver is having a noise bandwidth bn and gain g noise bandwidth bn and gain g these two parameters are also with respect to the practical network only these two parameters will not be varied and now what about the temperature yet what temperature this network is producing the noise that is the important factor here okay so t becomes now t e t becomes now t e where t e is t e is nothing but effective noise temperature effective noise temperature at which effective noise temperature at which the practical receiver or practical network is able to produce the noise delta n hope you understand okay for the ideal receiver we have taken it as k not nothing t not nothing but noise noise produced by the ideal receiver at room temperature at room temperature only we have operated that ideal receiver that is okay but in the practical receiver i see ideal means every condition is pure and no uh, no noise nothing but error free we can say it is error free so temperature also we considered at a room temperature we have not increased the temperature and we have not decreased the temperature we have just assumed the temperature as room temperature but now when coming to the practical receiver temperature may not be a room temperature it may be a some other temperature it may increase or decrease so at what temperature the network is able to produce this amount of noise like delta n so that we are taking it as effective noise temperature effective noise temperature te so we can write it as now substitute this value in equation 1 substitute delta n in equation 1 substitute delta n equation 1 what happens so we know fn is equal to 1 plus delta n by delta n by k t naught b n into g that is equal to 1 plus what is delta n k t e b n into g divided by k t naught b n into g so if you rearrange this it becomes only t e by t naught this is f now what is effective noise temperature therefore effective noise temperature t e is equal to it can be written as f n minus 1 into t naught this is effective noise temperature okay and what about system noise temperature system noise temperature is defined as the effective noise temperature of the receiver system including the effects of the antenna parameters t a so the effect to the system noise temperature system noise temperature t s is defined as the effect to <coughs> noise temperature effect to noise temperature 
including of the network including effects of antenna temperature ta including the effect of antenna temperature ta so just effect to noise temperature we know that as te te is nothing but what about te suppose if you are taking a network if you are taking this network and this is the in output and this is the input this is the place where we are having the antenna okay now if you are talking this network alone then te comes this net this net this net this net this network effect to noise temperature due to this network at which temperature the network is working but if you are taking the effect of this temperature of the antenna like ta then it becomes overall system noise temperature so system noise temperature ta is equal to ts is equal to te plus ta te plus ta total system noise temperature is equal to noise temperature of the network plus noise temperature of the antenna okay that can also be written as t t not into f s t not into f s okay this is the system noise figure multiplied by noise and uh, system noise figure multiplied by room temperature so where f s is nothing but system noise figure system noise figure we know t not is nothing but room temperature okay so in this way the noise temperature uh, effect to noise temperature and this is system noise temperature can be calculated